Hi there, welcome back to Pillars of Eternity. The Renegades of Panka here, highest difficulty level. And we are about to confront the Green Death Glass Dial. Show you why. We have a bounty on him in Lear Riemann. He also blocks our progress in Lear Riemann to uncover the secrets of this of this place. Secrets with a with a spare we have found. See, there's much more to explore here, like this, this strange coffin or something. So what we we have done is we have prepared for the fight against these. Now you only see the swamp spore, but there's a lot of opponents here, among them Adragans and all that kind of stuff. So um, we have prepared really well. As you wish. We need to position even better. And we need to, yeah, walk in there. Uh, it's going to get a bit, little bit tactical. So if you're here for the role play, this is I'm probably I'd be glad to. some big combat uh, encounter. And they're somehow not noticing us, so... I'm not sure what's going to come of that. We got Kevava here, and of course we needed your uh, Quarrel York Sword. Why do we need him? I'm here. Instantly, when combat begins, we need Quarrel to give us that buff, the Prayer Against Treasury. That is the most important hey thing in this fight. Oh. To be able to uh, do something against these freaking mushrooms so there we go prayer against treasury there we go mm, what do we have here definitely need to or want to put out the essential phantom to help us in this fight uh, we have Kewasa here who is on her anti-primordial thing, so she could attack the Swamp Spore. Wickerstein is still standing there. She'll stop Glass Dial along with him with Adonan. We've got Kevava, he's waiting as well. Oh, that's that. <laughs> nice going. <laughs> now now what would we want next we want the prayer against bewilderment against confusions that's the next important thing we have and now <laughs> next thing next problem we have is um worth it yeah we have a problem with the insect swarms here. Christine here, the duplicate is, is going on here. Let's attack the swamp spore with a duplicate. We have Kelvasa, who is doing something. Should shoot a swamp spore. We've got Gerstein. I got something special here for Gerstein. <laughs> She should just bomb with fireballs, or maybe with an arcane assault. Maybe that is enough. Look at that. That's really, really nice. Yeah, she should stop these guys here. Hmm. On the other hand, da uh, Archimedes Capricious Hex. So many things that we can do with that. Quarrel, Kelvasa, Vikstein. There's a Pugra. Attack it. And we've got Kevava. He should also run in. Christine is somehow blocked with something. We have the consecrated ground that is really not lasting yeah. long. Why is that? Should consecrate it again. But first we should run in here. 
Now let's consecrate this. <laughs> uh, the swamp spore. Yeah, it's barely injured. That's not good. That plague of insects. I mm -hmm. hate the plague. Who likes the plague, though? Who really likes it? We've got Lord Paul. Mm, what can he do? Try to run in somewhere. Ooh, there's a wind blight here. <sighs> Immune to crushing damage. We've got Kelvasa here. Mm -hmm. Too near, too near. Got Gustine. That swamp spore here. Still barely injured. Got Adaman. He should protect us from this wind blight. Because Teen and Kevava. Kevava's attacking the Pugra. He should probably attack the Wilder. Let's see. Anti Primordial, Anti Kith. No, he should definitely attack the Pugra. Did we do that spell? I don't think so. Let's try it again. Let's center it back here somewhere. Oh, we cannot. We have to center it this way. Nice. Now that worked. Can we access that area? Yeah, we can access it. So let's bomb them. Oh, all oh, that would be good too. The arcane assault. Definitely, as it dazes as well. The small wind blight is taking damage. Should send in Lord Paul. Let's see if we can somehow give him a reason to, to do this. Yeah, attack the swamp spore. I want you to kill it. <laughs> mm, and you. We have we have the tra treasury going on, the bewilderment protection going on. We need a dire blessing. Or we just need the blessing and the circle of pro the watchful presence. Let's go for the watchful presence right now. It's been a long time we've done this, but it should be okay. Mm -hmm. yeah. oh, come on. Can you move around a bit? And now let's go for the Watchful Presence. Where do we have it? Again, here. And that. Yeah, so... Yeah, Lord Paul <laughs> destroyed the Wind Blight. That's pretty good. The Consecrated Ground still running. Spot on. Need to redo it. It's somehow cancelled out all the time. Do we have here the Wilder? He's dazed. Let's attack him. The Rickestein. Should move in. Hmm, maybe she cannot move in. We could heal a bit. And yeah. That's really good. Let's do that. And we've got Christine with us. Uh, let's go for that fireball thing. Mm, but first, I think Arcane Assault is good. To keep them dazed. And let's throw Glass Dial down. Well. Bam, there we go. He's prone. That is suppressed for now, but... Still okay. Good change weapons here. And attack the swamp spore as well. There's something coming, a small flame blight. Oh yeah, you could change back. Attack the flame blight. Got Kelvasa. Uh yeah, you're just waiting here, Lord Paul, and protecting the back line. Uh, what do we want? more here. Um, piercing would be good against this, but do we really need that? I think I want that. 
Now a fireball is also not really good, but what is what is good? The chain lightning probably. Hmm. But we have to do something. Yeah, let's let's go for a fireball. I think that's not bad. We'll also probably hit. So it might be really good. Yes. Glass dial the wilder. Yeah, I think the swamp spores are the most dangerous beings out there. So it's good that we can destroy them with fireballs and stuff. Still the consecrated ground, uh, the, the insect swarms, I hate it so much. <laughs> oh. Now, glass dial is pretty tough it seems. So prayer against treachery, oh. still running, we need to keep track of this. Yeah. We take them down one by one. That one is down. Now let's attack that one. And Kelvasa can attack that one. Oh, you should move too. And attack here. Uh, what would we do again? Fireballs. <laughs> Fireballs are my prime weapon of choice. Now, I think there's a Swamp Spore here. Yes, there's still a Swamp Spore. So, we'll need to renew the prayer against treachery. Mm -hmm. <gasps> and that's how it's done. And we also renew the prayer against bewilderment. There's Glass Dial. Wow. He is hobbled, but not easy to take down. So let's blind him. Let's knock him down again. And I don't know. More fireballs. <laughs> We're pretty fireballsy here. Yes. Hmm. Crits for five crush damage. Look at that. Oh, he's nearly immune to crush. That's not good. We have the Kith slaying. We need to go back to Danulia and stuff. To hit that guy. It's blinded now. The swamp spore needs to go down. And we have her. Uh, she should change weapons, but before we have something to do. Aha, uh -huh. defense against all that kind of stuff. That would be a nice thing to have. Otherwise, yeah. Decrease damage reductions. Sacri nice. Now we can shoot again. The Swamp Spore, please. Christine is... she attacked. Here, Quarrel is here. Yeah. Oh, we would need a Blessing again. Oh, the first oh, Blessing, Robert. maybe. Quit. Really like another fireball here. Glass style is still up and running, but Ooh, with a spark. Maybe you should move here, and then you can attack the Saint Jerem's spark. Oh yeah, more fireballs. Did I say I love fireballs? I actually love fireballs.
What else could we go for? I would like other destructive measures. The Capricious Hex is good. A Miasma of Dull-Mindedness. Uh, the Necrotic Lens. I don't know. Let's Slicken now. Just because Slicken is always so fun. And it's also very effective. Hey there. Really. Worth it. Nice. <laughs> Look at that. The next swamp spores down. We need Kalvasa, Wickestein, and uh, maybe not Gerstein. I we need you two to attack the swamp spore here. So much for you. You. Come on, you should go over here. Why are you running there? Over here. Stand together. Attack the spore. And why are you running back? I want you to attack the freaking spore. Nice. Let's increase the damage to the spore. Hey there. Hmm. Still glass dial. What do we have here? Let's call for the chain lightning. Oh. Huh. Oh. And now we didn't need it. Oh, there's more corrupted druids. Hey, they have transformed into werewolves. Oh. Hey, the swamp spore is going down. That's good for us. Love. Now, this is really a fight. I mean, the other bounty quests were somehow easier. <laughs> this is definitely a tough fight. Mm, malignant Cloud. I never use the Malignant Cloud. I might as well... Like, leave it be. Hey. Hey, you. Oh, my. Oh, my. Dominated. Oh, no. Uh, can you change back? Oh, no. You should attack the swamp spore. There's only one swamp spore. What can it even do? I mean, what can it even... God. Swamp spore will kill us all. Yes. We need to move down here. I just have to try something Attack. else. With the seal. Spot on. Oh, we walked into a trap. No. Attack the spore. Wow. Hey there. Don't attack each other, please. I'm here. This was the fight against Glass Dial, the Green Death. Thank you for watching. Happy gaming to you, and see you in the next episode of the Renegades of Punk in Pillars of Eternity, Path of the Damned. This is Immanuel Khan signing out and wishing you happy gaming.